Hello, hello, happy December 3rd. So today I'm going to be doing kind of a larger watercolor painting because I'm not done with the watercolors yet. I want to have a little bit more fun and practice before I do more complicated things. So I figured I could go ahead and try a bit of a larger watercolor image today. I want to point out that I'm still not using watercolor paper, so it's probably going to warp, but that's okay. For this image, I'm going to be using a Faber-Castell black watercolor pencil and a bamboo brush. In general, I'm pretty bad at landscapes, if I'm going to be honest. Even in my comics, I don't usually Usually draw too many backgrounds just because I'm not very good at them. So this image was actually inspired by a scene from a movie called Risk Cutters A Love Story. It's a movie that one of my friends from Arizona showed me a few years ago and it very quickly became one of my favorite movies. Risk Cutters is about a world in which if you kill yourself you just end up in another world with everyone else who's ever killed themselves. So everything is exactly the same, just a little bit worse. And my absolute favorite scene in this movie is the one where one of the characters tells the story of a crooked tree and a straight tree. And he says, once upon a time there was a crooked tree and a straight tree, and they grew next to each other. And every day the straight tree would say to the crooked tree, you're crooked. You've always been crooked and you will continue to be crooked. But look at me, look at me, said the straight tree. I'm tall and I'm straight. And then one day the lumberjacks came into the forest and they looked around and the manager in charge said, cut all the straight trees. And that crooked tree is still there to this day, growing strong and growing strange. And that's a story that I really relate to because when I was in high school, I was not the prettiest or the most popular or the smartest. I was just the quiet school artist who was kind of always on my own. And in a lot of ways I feel like I can relate to the crooked tree. So I took inspiration from that story and decided to draw Chewie here under a crooked tree alone on a hillside with a forest of straight trees off in the distance. I feel like we should all learn from the crooked tree and continue to grow strong and grow strange. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. If you would like to win this and 23 other signed prints, please consider donating to our CrowdRise charity campaign via the link in the description. Proceeds from this event will be given to the nonprofit organization to write love on her arms via the CrowdRise platform.